is buzzing with a new show geared especially for children. It's called A Buzzy Bee, and here to talk to us about it, um, we have Linda and Bill from Sharp Literacy, Literacy and from Florentine. Good morning. Thank you for being here. Pleasure guys. to be here. Good morning. Okay, so let's first talk about Sharp Literacy for people who may not know about it. Tell us about it. Sure. Sharp Literacy's mission is to energize urban school children to be um, better readers, writers, researchers through the use of visual arts and hands-on interaction. Interesting. And why is this so important? This is so important. Um, the, the collaboration and partnership with the Florentine Opera has been, um, this is a, a two-year partnership, um, and it's just been so wonderful working with them. Sharp Literacy also um, produces books, and one of our We Love to Learn books is The Busy Bee. So it was a great opportunity when Bill and his folks uh, asked us about the possibility of, of taking this book and making it into a children's um, opera. And it, here we are two years later, and it's, um, it's just a phenomenal um, children's opera that um, we take from, from school to school. Very cool. And how did this partnership come about with Florentine Opera and with Sharp Literacy? How'd you guys come together? Well, our former education director came to me and said, what do you think about this as an idea? And so then we reached out to Sharp and uh, Linda and her folks were just immediately intrigued by the idea, thankfully. And, um, and we took it from there. So they were, they were great in terms of saying, so real quick, we have less than 30 seconds now. Okay. But tell us about the opera. Why is this important? What can kids get from the message? Well, you all, of the great, all of the great messages that happen with Sharp Literacy, and then they're also in, introduced to the arts through singing, the visual arts, um, theatrics, all of those things. Opera combines all of those things together, and then you add in what Sharp Literacy does, and it's a really impactful program for kids all over our city. This will be performed about nearly 100 times yes. until what? Until May Until May. Yeah, about 15,000 kids will see it by the time yes. we're all done. We've already seen about three or 4,000 up to this point already. Amazing that so many kids will be exposed to this as well. And there's an opportunity for the public to also check this out as right. well. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. All right. Thank you so much for your time this morning. We really appreciate it. Pleasure. We will be right back after break, but you can check out more information on our website, wisn.com slash weekend.